congratulations, big two points. And she top the table again, must be over the moon. What's your emotions after that? Yeah, it was really important this one. Uh, we all could see how much it, it meant to me, uh, it means a lot to me. But for me, I'm, I can work further in the tournament and I feel good, but there's still more to come, man. Uh, with the crowds, everything, it's a little bit. Uh, you need to get used to it again, man. Uh, I feel good, but it's still a little bit weird. March the 12th in Liverpool was the last time we had anything like this a long, long time. Last night when you were walking up those steps, what did that feel like for you? Yeah, goosebumps. That's the only thing I can say. The, the crowd's been phenomenal so far, and uh, I hope they keep enjoying this. This is what dance is about, about enjoying themselves, and we are performing on the stage, there's dance. And I, I know I, I've been in the pressure in the last months, but from here on, I only can look to the bright side. You admitted yourself last night for letting yeah, you know, get to the ring. Of course, the, uh, when, when you give a player like Nathan Espo a little bit of breath, he's going to take advantage of that, and that's exactly what happened. And I, I, I should be no better than that, but unfortunately uh, things like that happen. Gary Anderson tonight, man always plays well against you, always nice to get one over on him. Yeah, of course, always nice to beat him, especially when, when he gets lined up, because then I know I went under the skin, and it's when you win the game for, and you need to win your games, if you want to win this title, you shouldn't have no mercy with anyone. If you were to go on and win this, does this mean more than the other Premier Leagues could want, no. because of what's happened in the last Just game? another tournament, mate, you know what I'm like. It's, uh, it, it seems like that I'm a robot, because I don't care what title it is, any competition I'm entering, I want to win, simple as that. And whatever I have to do for it, of course, it doesn't always work my way, but I've got an end goal, and that's really important. Jose de Souza tomorrow, he said tonight the pressure's going to be on you when, he, when you play him tomorrow, and thinks yes. you're going to have to play better to beat him, do you agree? Yeah, the pressure will be on my shoulders right away. If this works out my way, I'm qualified for the semi-final, and he's not. So he, he needs to make sure I'm... Uh, I'm not going to better him like I do last game. Michael, did you feel a little bit more relaxed tonight? A little bit, a little bit, a little bit. But I was trying too hard last night, definitely. But uh, that doesn't say that's okay. I need to just need to get used to it again, and then I feel good. I feel comfortable, and from here on, I think I can work further in the tournament. Top of the table without always being the brilliant best. Is that what that's, that's, the best? Yeah. Uh, could you imagine if I was playing my A game constantly, but that's not the case at the moment and you need to be realistic to yourself and uh, face the facts and uh, that's exactly what I do. The only thing I have to do is need to make sure I have a good night rest tonight and make sure I'm there tomorrow night. With the fans back at the motivation levels as high as we've ever been again? Yeah, but what can you wish more? This has been phenomenal, this has been uh, good for us, good for sport overall. But also for the dark place, for the fans, it's time we can give something back as well. Michael, do you think it's going to take a while for yourself? I can hear me, sorry. Do you think it's going to take a while for yourself and the other players to adapt to this sort of situation? Yeah, of course, because we had to deal with no crowds for so many months and we don't want to get used to it, but unfortunately, uh, that's the case and you need to get used to it, but overall, I know there's more to go for. I know I still have to work hard, but gradually I'm getting there. Do you feel like with just two games left, you're in a good position, get the points on the board and use the momentum from those last two games into the playoffs? Yeah, of course, that's what you have to do. You need to get your confidence, you need to put the pressure on the other people, because if you do that, you're one, one step ahead, and that's why I like to, to keep doing constantly.